Thanks for joining us here on News Nation Russia. I'm Nicole Burley, and President Biden hosting a roundtable today touting what he calls a small business boom. News Nation hearing from some owners who say that's not exactly the case, and a new report on the economy this week could explain their struggles. Correspondent Evan Lambert is live for us in Washington. So, Evan, big businesses are just fine, but it's not the same story for their smaller counterparts. Nicole, corporate profits, they are skyrocketing. But according to this new study out this week, small businesses, they are struggling when it comes to inflation. From a winery in downtown Indianapolis that's grown grapes since 1974. All of those costs have gone up. To a florist shop in East Texas, working to keep up with the skyrocketing demand for weddings now that the COVID pandemic is ebbing. Prices in general have gone up 30% across the nation. It's not just us, it's everywhere. Small business owners telling our News Nation stations across the country they're feeling the strain of supply chain issues, inflation, and the race to find and retain employees. <laughs> At Easley Winery, they estimate prices of production have gone up 15 to 35 percent. The biggest jump bottles for their signature product. Since natural gas prices have gone up, the prices to fuel those furnaces to make the glass have gone up. Corporations have also blamed supply chain and worker shortage issues, though many still posted hefty profits last year. A new Goldman Sachs study shows small businesses are taking a big hit as inflation spikes. 91% of small business owners say larger economic trends are negatively impacting their business. On inflation specifically, which is the worst it's been in 40 years, 88% say inflationary pressures on their business have increased since January, which means higher prices are are likely to pass down to the register. But the White House claiming there's been a small business boom under the administration's watch. President Biden touting job growth at an event Thursday and plans to help more Americans create and maintain small businesses. Today, thanks to the economic strategy, more, uh, more small businesses are being created and small businesses are creating more jobs faster than ever before. Nicole, big and small businesses have blamed several things, including the supply chain and rising wages for cutting into their bottom lines. But according to the Commerce Department for corporations, their profits are as high as they've been since 1950. Nicole. All right, Evan, thank you for that. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.